Detectives believe they're closer to finding the cause of the deadly Pinery bushfire after identifying the farmers who were first to fight the blaze. The breakthrough comes after police launched a public appeal for information. A police command point was set up in Malala this morning so residents could share information about the blaze that came so close to the small town. Barry Omani told officers many locals weren't prepared because they didn't know it was coming. They need to be aware of the fact that people sometimes don't get the phone messages. But details about what caused the inferno, which claimed two lives and destroyed 85 homes, were hard to come by. The 10 waiting police officers greeted by only a handful of people. Uh, look, it's a very hot day. Um, um, we understand that. Um, but we'll be here till 9 o'clock tonight. Police did receive crucial information last night after making a plea via the media. The farmers who first fought the blaze and cut open a fence to reach the flames finally coming forward. They are the first on scene. They saw where the fire was. They know the direction of the fire. They can articulate what their beliefs were, where the fire may have originated from. So far the best clue as to what sparked the inferno is a battery found alongside an electric fence near where it started. The battery absolutely is a strong line of inquiry. Some of the people who came here this afternoon asked not to be on camera. Among them was a local man who says he lost his home in the blaze and also a fire cause investigator who's been employed by insurance companies to prepare an independent report into the cause. Total insured losses stand at almost $120 million but that could increase with an updated figure due tomorrow. Ben Avery, Nine News.